Beneath the emerald canopy of Central and South American rainforests, a vibrant spectacle graces the skies, the era macau, commonly known as the scarlet macaw. Join us on an awe-inspiring journey into the world of this majestic parrot, as we unravel its evolutionary history, ecological significance, and the challenges it confronts. The vibrant scarlet macaw is one of the most recognizable parrots in the world, beloved for its bright plumage and loud, raucous calls. Scarlet macaws have captivated humans for centuries, inspiring mythology, art, and wildlife conservation efforts across their range in the neotropics of Central and South America. As large, long-lived parrots that spend most of their lives in mating pairs, scarlet macaws are important for seed dispersal and forest regeneration. However, habitat loss and poaching for the pet trade have led to population declines, and scarlet macaws are now considered a threatened species. Evolutionary History the evolutionary origins of scarlet macaws date back to the early Miocene epoch, when ancestral macaws likely flew over tropical landscapes in what is now South America over 20 million years ago. The earliest fossils of true macaws date to around 10 million years ago in the Miocene. Over millions of years, ancestral scarlet macaws likely speciated from the genus era and spread northwards into Central America as new habitats arose. Today's era macau is believed to be most closely related to the green-winged macaw, a. chloropterus, based on DNA evidence. Scarlet macaws belong to the large and diverse order Cytosines, which contains over 390 species of parrots worldwide. This order originated in the ancient supercontinent Gondwana when Australia, Antarctica, and South America were connected. After the continents broke apart tens of millions of years ago, parrots diversified extensively in Australia and South America. Scarlet macaws thus share a common ancestor with all other neotropical parrots such as Amazons, Kanas, and Kayaks. This shared evolutionary history explains similarities across parrot species like zygodactyl feet, hooked beaks, and vocal mimicry abilities. Within the macaw family, in the subfamily era, scarlet macaws are classified in a clade containing almost all of the large macaw species, including hyacinth and green-winged macaws. DNA evidence suggests scarlet macaws are the basal lineage in this clade, having been the first large macaw species to diverge from a common ancestor. All era macaws share key traits like large curved beaks, long tails, bare facial patches, and complex feather colors. Over millions of years, natural and sexual selection have refined scarlet macaws' appearance for surviving in tropical forests and attracting mates. With their bright plumage and loud calls, scarlet macaws have an unmistakable presence in their native habitat. Their most striking feature that gives them their common name is the sea of bright red feathers covering most of their body, wings and tail. Only the forehead, eye stripe, primary flight feathers and thighs are other colors, mostly pale yellow on their forehead graduating into blue and dark blue on their wingtips. The bare facial patch is white with few lines of pale feathers. Their beak is black with light striations along the cutting edges. Scarlet macaws are large, long-tailed parrots averaging 33 inches, 85 centimeters, long and weighing 2 to 2.5 pounds, 1 to 1.2 kilograms. They have a wingspan reaching 4 feet, 120 centimeters. Their wings are long and pointed, allowing them to be fast and agile flyers. Their long graduated tails assist with in-flight steering and braking. Scarlet macaws share physical traits common to all macaws, like a large curved beak that easily cracks hard nuts and fruits. They also have zygodactyl feet, two toes face forward and two face backwards, that enable gripping and climbing. Like other parrots, scarlet macaws sport a ring of bright bare facial skin around each eye. They also lack an external pinny or fleshy external ear, just a small opening directly leading to their middle ear. Their nares, nostrils, have a complex internal structure assisting with olfactory senses and heat exchange. Scarlet macaws sport a blush patch under wings and tail that turns brighter red when they are excited. Relative to body size, scarlet macaws have smaller brains than many birds. But they have well-developed visual processing centers, reflective of their highly visual and spatial nature. Their brains also have large hippocampuses aiding their impressive long-term memories. Physiologically, scarlet macaws are high-energy birds with efficient cardiorespiratory systems and low metabolic rates, ideal adaptations for frequent, long-distance flights. Ecology Scarlet macaws inhabit lowland tropical rainforests from southeastern Mexico through Central America into Amazonian South America. This includes diverse ecosystems like tropical evergreen forests, seasonal forests, swamp forests, semi-deciduous woodlands, and savannas with palm groves. 
They generally occur at altitudes below 1,000 meters but can occasionally be found higher where suitable habitat exists. Most populations reside in protected nature reserves and indigenous territories rich in fruit trees. As habitat generalists, scarlet macaws can tolerate some habitat degradation provided sufficient nesting sites and food sources remain. However, extensive deforestation has extirpated them from parts of their former range. Forest fragmentation is especially problematic, as scarlet macaws require vast territories upwards of 25 square kilometers to find sufficient food year-round. Ideal scarlet macaw habitat includes an intact canopy layer with tall, mature trees for nesting alongside open areas with palms for feeding and roosting. Scarlet macaws play several important functional roles in their ecosystems. As large-bodied frugivores and granivores, they are essential seed dispersers and help shape forest composition. They also facilitate seed germination by scarifying the seed coat within their beaks. By nesting in tree hollows, they contribute to nutrient cycling when nest debris, feathers, eggshells etc., collects inside the hollow. As prey species themselves, scarlet macaws supplement the diets of apex predators like harpy eagles and jaguars. Overall scarlet macaws promote higher levels of biodiversity and forest regeneration wherever they occur. Habitat and Behavior Scarlet macaws exhibit complex behaviors and social dynamics crafted by millions of years of evolution. They spend over 60% of daylight hours flying and foraging. Each mating pair establishes a permanent territory which they defend from intruders and nest within annually. Pairs will mate for life unless one dies. All behaviors revolve around this tightly bonded breeding pair working together to maintain its territory and raise offspring successfully. Pair bonding starts when scarlet macaws reach sexual maturity at 3 to 5 years old. Pairs partake in mutual grooming and courtship feeding to reinforce social ties. Copulation occurs frequently to stimulate a strong pair bond. Once bonded, pairs become highly synchronized, flying, vocalizing, perching and feeding together. Coordinated territorial defense is also key, as pairs defend precious nesting sites and food resources from competing macaws. Dramatic fights break out in aerial macaw wars, with birds grabbing each other's feet and beaks while shrieking loudly. These skirmishes establish clear territorial boundaries between neighboring pairs. Scarlet macaw territories often center around a nest tree, usually a tall, mature canopy giant with a hollow trunk or limb. Pairs return to and defend these prime nest sites annually. Nest preparation starts as early as January when pairs line the hollow with fresh leaves. Then from February, June the female lays one to four eggs clutches, incubating them for about a month. Chicks hatch altricial but fully feathered with closed eyes. Both parents tend the nest, regulate temperatures, and feed regurgitated food like fruit pulp and nuts to the chicks. After three months fledglings emerge from the nest and follow their parents during daily foraging routines as they master flight and independence. When not breeding, most of a scarlet macaw pair's day focuses on foraging widely across their territory for fruit and seeds. Their large beaks allow them to exploit various tree species like moriche palms, sabas, and kapok trees. Strong jaws crack open even the hardest nuts like macadamias. Pears also visit traditional geophagy sites to consume clay which detoxifies plant defensive chemicals. Throughout the day pears take breaks to preen each other's feathers, rest together, and vocalize loudly, behavior that constantly reinforces their lifelong pear bond. Conclusion The scarlet macaw remains an iconic species across Central and South America due to its aesthetic appeal and cultural significance for indigenous groups. However, its specialized life history strategy and reliance on intact rainforests has led to concerning population declines. The IUCN Red List categorizes scarlet macaws as least concern but notes an ongoing population reduction. While some protected populations remain stable, illegal trafficking for the caged bird trade has decimated others. It is estimated only 2,500 mature scarlet macaws exist in the wild. Without active, science-based conservation, scarlet macaws could face extirpation from parts of their range. Conservation efforts today focus on anti-poaching enforcement, nest monitoring slash protection, captive breeding, and forest preservation initiatives engaging indigenous communities who revere scarlet macaws. Several reserves like Peru's Tombopata National Reserve and Guatemala's Maya Biosphere.